can't lie though, Andrew, it does make me want to play Crisis 3. I'm gonna have to get, see if somebody wants to buy it for me for another Let's Play. Cause I'm enjoying, it's die. Yeah, I'd really like to, I think, I think I need to play Crisis 1 too. Cause I, I enjoy the storyline. I just don't feel well. So here you are, Theseus at last. Welcome. No, I spent eight hours in the hospital so yesterday, dude. Eh? Crack the labyrinth, and you would at least expect to see the Minotaur before it kills you. Ah, well, it seems only fair. Come then. Masks off. I am here. <coughs> I would be. I'd revel in it if I were you. That sudden jump of the pulse, the cram of the fight or flight chemicals into the belly. So sweet while it lasts. But it's been very long what is since this? I felt any of it. A century or more since my pleasures were anything but cerebral. I took the path Carl Rash refused, the cold road to immortality. I'd hope to wear Prophet's suit myself, take on the weapons he brought us, wear his armor, enter the labyrinth and confront the Minotaur. But now, you, you will have to finish what Prophet began. Get out of there, Alcatraz. No, wait. There is a final piece of the puzzle you need. There on the desk. Take the syringe. Take it. Yes, there. The Jungle's Guard Iteration. The key to all gates. You think I'm based in this cesspit city because I like it here? You were waiting for them. Why didn't you warn someone? Warn whom? Humanity at large? Look what you've done, old man! They're here! You That's right, Nathan. The owners are back. Waking the systems, firing up the boiler, back to spring clean the old family residence. And not much liking what they found festering behind the fridge. Can you blame them, really? Ah, the angels of death at last. My escort back to human frailty. Well, took you long enough. Become the prophet. Take on his armor. 
drink for your species, for humanity and all its fumbling, half-made glory. Get out of there, Alcatraz. <laughs> Of death at last, my escort back to human frailty. Well, took you long enough. Become prophet. Take on his armor. Strike for your species, for humanity, and all its fumbling, half-made glory. Get out of there, Alcatraz. <laughs> yes, that's it. Go, go. Save us all. Try this again. Ah, the angels of death at last. My escort back to human frailty. Well, become prophet. Take on his armor. Strike for your species, for humanity, and all its fumbling, half made glory. Get out of there, Alcatraz. <laughs> yes, that's it. Go, go. Save us all. <laughs> of death at last. I don't My escort back to human frailty. Well, become prophet. Take on his armor. Strike for your species, for humanity, and all its fumbling, half-made glory. Get out of there, Alcatraz. <laughs> yes, that's it. Go, go. Save us all. <laughs> This is Jacob Hargreave to all cell personnel. Commander Lockhart is dead. I will be joining him shortly, and the PRISM facility is wired to explosively self-destruct. Subject Prophet is now your only hope of... Ah, the angels of death at last. My escort back to human frailty. Well... Become prophet. Take on his armor. Strike for your species, for humanity, and all its fumbling, half-made glory. Get out of there, Alcatraz. <laughs> yes, that's it. Go, go. Save us all. <laughs> this is Jacob Hargreave to all cell personnel. Commander Lockhart is dead. I will be joining him shortly, and the PRISM facility is wired to explosively self-destruct. Subject Prophet is now your only hope of turning back the alien invasion. You will therefore discontinue hostilities and afford him every assistance you can, as you evacuate this island. All PRISM facilities will explosively self-seal in 10 minutes. Your employee duties are terminated. Please exit via the indicated channels. Alcatraz, the roof is trashed. There's nothing flyable up here. I'm heading for the Queensboro Bridge. Meet me on the far side if you can. Need backup. Yeah, this way. Boom. The hole taking fire.
left in his life. This place is going up. You've got to get out of there. We gotta get off this fuck! be an afterlife, I wonder, choirs of angels, or a fiery pit. One unlearns these falsehoods over time, but the child who learns to fear hell is never really gone. To tell the truth, I think I've had quite enough of afterlives as it is. This one has been pretty purgatorial. Almost 50 years floating in super cool jelly like some medical specimen. Thoughts creeping like rats through the cramped silicon corridors on, of machines, way. trapped oh, oh, behind video screens and camera systems. Never sleeping, never resting, never ceasing to think about the world you no longer belong to. No, if this is a taste of the afterlife, I think simple oblivion will do nicely. All prison facilities will explosively self-heal and kill you fast. Your employment duties are terrible.